Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm gonna walk you through how to exactly recover all of your Snapchat photos, videos, messages, everything. You can get it all back if you've deleted your messages, your photos, all of that. You can get it back on the iPhone or Android. I'm gonna walk you through those steps on the iPhone, but they work the exact same on the Snapchat um, app on your Android device itself. So the first thing that we'll want to do is make sure that we've updated Snapchat. So let's go into our app store here and then just type in Snapchat. And the reason why we're gonna do this is because um, the, we'll recover all the data, but they've upgraded the feature to recover all the data in the latest Snapchat app. So you can see here, I typed in Snapchat. You can see that it just says open. If it says update, then you wanna update it first. But if it just says open, then it's fully updated. So the next step that we'll do is we'll just head into Snapchat itself. So we're in Snapchat here. The first thing that we'll want to do is to recover your data. Um, so Snapchat has an awesome feature that lets you recover the data. The first thing that you'll do is tap on your profile icon at the top left here. And then you'll see a gear icon on the top right. We'll just tap on that for the next step. And you can see all of this information here. Um, you'll scroll all the way down. It might be in a different spot depending on if you're on iPhone or Android, but it should be towards the bottom here. So you can see the second to the last option is called My Data. So we'll tap on that. And it'll bring up something, a page just like this. So the next step, You'll have to log in. If you don't know your username or password, you'll have to recover that first and then be able to log in to get all your data. But I'll just log in here real quick on my account. I'm not a robot. I'll do the crosswalk. And then it should let me in to recover all my data. Oh, it looks like I need to enter in the code that I just received. So you might get this little text message code 902666, 902666. So you can see that you might have that request that you have to enter in a uh, code that was texted to you if you have two-factor authentication turned on. But anyway, so we're in it now and it says my data and it says data available in the app, your name, your username, your email, um, you can see towards the bottom there, your memories, your permissions, but then it says data available to download. And all of these ones with the check marks are things that you can download. So you'll go down here and you can see snap history. So your snap history is something that you can download. Um, your friends, your public profile, your story history, if you want to send um, your story history, but you know, you've basically deleted it or it's not available anymore, you can download that. Um, you can go down here, you can send, you know, your memories, your snaps, um, your places, your email history, all that, your search history, all that stuff. So in here you can recover your photos, your videos, and any of your messages that you want. All you have to do is hit that submit request button. And then you can see we've, requ we've received your request and then we're gonna send it to you. So just wait like five or 10 minutes and you'll get an email from Snapchat. It'll walk you through the steps to, uh, to download that data and it'll all be on your phone that you can use. You can send it as a text message or whatever you want. So that's the first step, but keep in mind, this doesn't work for everything. So we'll walk you through two more steps that you might wanna take to be able to recover those, especially those photos and those videos. So the next thing is depending on the features on your iPhone or Android, you might have any of your snaps saved to uh, your photos or your camera gallery. So we'll open up our photos and you'll just want to scroll through here and see, you know, is there anything on here that is, you know, the snap that I'm looking for. So you can scroll back, you can find the specific date and try to see, is that the snap that I'm looking for? Potentially say it was this video and then I can recover it. I can send it to, you know, my friend's email, text message, whatever. However, so this is the second step. The third step that you'll want to take 
is to swipe out of here and we'll go back into Snapchat. So once you're in Snapchat, we'll just exit out of here and go back to the main home screen. One of the cool features is if you're on the screen that it has the video and everything, another thing that you can do is swipe up and it'll show you all your snaps. So here you can see a couple of my snaps. At the very top, you can see stories. I can go over to stories. And if you had stories, it would show you all of your stories here that you can recover. You can go over to camera roll. That's what we just looked at. That's the camera roll on your specific computer. We can go over to screenshots. It'll show you all the screenshots that you have. And then one of my favorite is my eyes only. So this is stuff that you've saved that you've kind of password protected that are just specific to you. So you enter in your password and you can see all of the photos and videos and everything that you've saved as my eyes only. So walking through all three of these steps, you should be able to recover all of your photos and videos and everything. Hope this helps. Let us know if you have any questions in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks.